Dear viewers, welcome to this episode of Enforce Tech TV live from Enforce Tech 2022. Together with me is Bernard from ACS. Bernard, thank you very much for your time. Thank you for having us. So before we go into your company and see what product we are going to talk about today, I want to ask you, how, what does it feel like to be back at Enforce Tech? So to be honest, it's a great feeling, like to get the direct contact with the customer or potential customer, partners again. It's just a great feeling having that face-to-face -face dialogue, of course, feels great. I mean, video conference is fine too, but the whole atmosphere is just different and just feels better ha having those events in person. It's, it's different on the ground, right? Definitely is. For those viewers who do not know about ACS, what does your company produce and what does it stand for? So ACS uh, stands for Armored Car Systems, um, and obviously we do produce obviously. armored cars. Um, we started in 2003. We're a, we're a rather small manufacturer. We're about 40 to 50 people. Okay. Um, and our main business has always been military vehicles with the G-Wagon as the basis. So the G-Wagon is always the base of your product? Always. Okay. We're, we're, so we have a good partnership with Mercedes, not exclusive, but a good partnership that has been established since 2003. And um, we just think the G-Wagon is one of the best vehicles for the military and the special forces. I believe there's many more people who also believe this, but let's take a deep dive. Let's give us a rundown of the new Anok AB. What are, holy cow, there's gonna be a lot of features. So where do we start? So first of all, um, let's start with the basic features. Um, the the G-Wagon as a basis is a very reliable vehicle. Um, it's combat proven for so many years and years um, throughout the whole world. Um, so this is, this, is the, the, this is the best point where we can start, I figure, because Mercedes as a brand, as a name, um, it's just known worldwide. It stands for quality and um, service. It's just overall a good product. And that's why we're based on the G-Wagon, because we want to give the customer the best possible experience and, of course, the best possible product. And that starts with the chassis. So, Mercedes providing the chassis. What do you build on top of that? So, when we get the naked chassis, we start with uh, the work on the body. Let's, okay. let's just go over there real quick. So we can have a closer look. Um, as you can see here, we have uh, the, the floor and the front wall. Those parts are protected or pre-equipped for protection. Um, of course, that's where the work starts. And those are basically the only parts that are welded. The All rest right. of this vehicle is basically just screwed, okay? So um, the idea behind this vehicle is that we can show a lots of different variants okay. with just one base vehicle. So that's why we came up with those profiles as a body. Okay. We, de we designed those profiles ourselves. They're similar to Bosch or Item profiles, uh, have the same features, which means you can, you can uh, put the, you can put the... So you can put the attachment system? I can, I, exactly. I can, so I can put the attachment system in here and basically can adapt everything anywhere. So no matter what my target is or what my mission is, I as, for example, a, a soft operator, I'm going to be able to configure this vehicle exactly for the task needed. Exactly for the task needed. Of course, we, we already developed different variants like a group transport, material transport, okay. medic, whatever. So Three configurations. Exactly, exactly. So we have that already set up. But of course, um, you can basically attach all the things you need by yourself because the system is very easy. We have those those common rails, we have airline rails everywhere where you can just take those parts, they're like Amazon 
less than a euro and you can basically just attach them everywhere you this want. vehicle is one big giant attachment point it definitely is <laughs> and okay. that is that is the main that, that is basically the unique selling point of this vehicle that you can show so many different variants with just one one vehicle so you basically get around 20 vehicles with just one okay who gives you all these, where does your company get all the experience and insights from? Is this vehicle, is this already in use? Do you get feedback from uh, special units who also are using this vehicle and maybe give you insight on how to improve on the existing configurations? So in the past, we uh, produced the Enoch 5.4 and the Enoch 6.2. So that's basically where we started with the tactical vehicles. Um, and those vehicles are combat proven. They've been to Afghanistan, whatever. Um, so we get feedback from, from the users there. We always speak with the customer. We're always happy if some former soldier or active soldier talks to us and says, hey, I've driven your car in Afghanistan. It's great, or that was trash. Can you, can you do that different? Yes. We're always happy for every bit of feedback we get. And if the feedback is coming from the first hand, of course, that's always the best. So we always try to gather all the information possible to deliver the best product that we can. So, and I believe you can get a lot of feedback out of this project as it's already in use. But uh, let's just have a quick look while we're at it into the interior. For example, I can see there's already Molly attached to the roof. Was that one of those inside of uh, maybe people who use that? Well, basically everybody likes it if they have something where they can put their stuff to. That's why we integrated Moller everywhere. Like we have it on the roof inside, we have it on the roof outside, we have it on the back of the seat. Basically everywhere is Molly, for example. So the soldier can mount his weapon or whatever, his munition, whatever. Again, one big attachment point. If you happen to now be curious about ACS products, about their cars, about their pre-configuration and maybe what they can deliver for your critical mission essentials, where can people find you? So, information is always available, of course, on the website. We're located in near Augsburg, that's between Munich and Stuttgart, like half an hour from Munich. Um, we're always happy for people to stop by. And um, also there are some, some insights on YouTube if you just Google the company. All right. We've had, uh, we've had some, some YouTubers in our facilities a couple years ago. Okay. Yeah, it's, it's definitely interesting. And it's, it's a YouTuber you know, so. So Bernard, thank you very much for your time. Also, if you happen to like this video, please feel free to give it a like. If you have a question, please feel free to drop it in the comment section below. And we'd be happy to earn your trust and a subscription to this channel. Bernard, thank you very much thank for your you. time.